wear glasses. So when we breathe on, you know, the lenses and fog them up, the moisture we're getting on there, that's, that's the aerosol. Scientific studies before this pandemic have shown that low cost masks, and when, so when we're talking about surgical masks and the cloth masks we're wearing, these low cost masks have pore sizes that range between 80 and 500 microns in size. So a huge range, right? The, the diameter of the virus is one micron. The largest possible small droplet that can comprise a typical aerosol and two viral particles is 62 microns in diameter. So let's not put that in perspective. The smallest pore size is 80. So that means the largest droplet coated with the virus can pass right through. Now, so let, let me see if I can show you this. We've been told to, to use up to three masks. So I've got one, and I actually don't know if I'm going to be able to get all these on, because one of the things that's interesting, actually, my right ear pin now is permanently uh, deformed a little bit. It sticks out from my head more than the other one um, because of all the mask wearing. But So let me put on, here's two masks. Here's three. I'll put on a fourth one. I don't know if we'll get the fifth one on. Okay, so I've got five masks. They're three-ply surgical masks, so 15 layers. I'm going to seal it around the mouth. If this is true, the aerosols have come through, then this should fog up. We'll see. Can you see that fog? Now, watch this. I've made a cross. Can you see my eyes through that cross? So there's so much moisture there that you can see. Look, look at that cross pattern. There's so much moisture there. So I'm not going to say anymore, right? All I'm saying, I'm just pointing with the science. So this is crazy.